state-enforced homosexuality is real, and a Florida teen found out the hard way they are charged with a felony after vandalizing a rainbow gay pride crosswalk by spinning his tires. Witness is telling cops that he performed multiple burnouts. Back in my day, we called him a motherfucking legend, but today we're now calling him a felon. And because we cannot desecrate the LGBTQ flag, because our holy people whom we love, who only add great things to this environment, like HIV, the proliferation of other sexually transmitted diseases, and of course, child station i wanted to celebrate the lgbtq community today by looking at the greatest examples among us with a short video brian let's play the video well fill me with hormone blockers and fuck me in the ass we're celebrating the most beautiful women among us and we're talking about men who would dare to desecrate their flag reminding you that not only do gay people remind us they're not Americans, they have their own country with their own flag, but black people have their own national anthem. It's almost like when we ask ourselves, are these people really like us? Well, they answer the question themselves, but it looks like the transgender community in the United States, it, they're trying to get made fun of. And that's unfortunate because everyone knows the slightly offensive is the greatest supporter of LGBTQ rights. We want nothing more for these people, but to thrive in their own land. We don't just love Israel and want Israel to exist. We want everyone to have their own country, including black people. 